Hi everyone welcome to my channel, in this video I'm going to show you some good settings for Winlader and also the best Winlader version. We all know that there are a lot of mod Winlader out there, so what is the best Winlader for now? Is there anything good about the other version or modded version? Well based on my experience I tried all of this mod Winlader and some of this app are pretty good when it comes to performance. And also some of them are good in compatibility and the others are not that good enough. Before we start I will show you some of my best settings and quick setup for win later. Note I'm not an expert on this but I will try to share all my knowledge and what I experience about all the emulators. For the win later version I'm using this win later by AFA mod. This version is the Chinese so I can't understand what's update change logs that's why I'm using Google Translate to what? understand what's update change logs are Bro, written. What are you talking about man? And that's all the change logs. Now let's go to settings and setup. In the first step how to add some modified wine, turnip driver, DXVK, box 60 for etc. You need to click the three line on the top left and then click content. Now to add some files you need to download files to the official release to avoid any errors. Download all WCP files. For example I chose a turnip file to install then I will find that file to install content. Again you need WCP file to install some content. After you choose file click continue. As you can see I already installed the turnip file. And that's how to install some of WCP files. Now we move to my settings, you can copy my files if you want but most of my games am using these settings without any problem. And if you are having problems with the Chinese language you can change it by choosing LC underscore I'll then click the N underscore S.UTF-8 for the English text languages. Now let's go for the controller setup. 
To connect the controller you need to connect with the Bluetooth. Then go to the input controls you will see automatically connect your controller in the WinLater external controller. As you can see my controller is now connected and detected by a WinLater. You can now test some games.
What about your thoughts on this video please comment down. If you want more videos like this you hit that subscribe button and notification bell to always notify you on my latest update. Thanks for watching see you on my next update.